on my fourth spacewalk, uh, you know, I was all familiar with getting out of the hatch, translating around the station, felt like home, felt like being here at the neutral buoyancy lab, like I've done this a million times. So I was pretty confident in what I was doing. I was all the way out on the port side of the truss and uh, getting ready to um, maneuver one of the bolts uh, that we needed to uh, drive to connect two of the pieces of the space station truss together. Um, this was what we call a get-ahead task, which means a task that we think that maybe if we're running ahead and we're doing really good, we're going to do. So again, having a little bit of confidence, um, getting ahead, being ahead of the timeline, they're like, hey, why don't you start working on this bolt? Well, I'm driving the bolt with what we call a pistol grip tool, which is a big drill, and it's driving a big bolt, probably about a half-inch size bolt, and as it's driving, it's fairly long, too. It's maybe about a half a foot long. It's driving, since it's driving this way, driving out, it's pulling my pistol grip tool to my right. I was paying attention to the part that I was trying to disconnect, and as I was doing that, I wasn't watching the other side of the pistol grip tool, and the pistol grip tool actually hit an electrical connector and bent it, because it had that much force coming out. Um, immediately when I felt a little bit of resistance on the tool, I stopped. I realized I had bent a connector. Um, ask for them, their assistance, what we needed to do and to make sure uh, you can finish the tasks correctly. We have helmet cam, which is pretty neat, so the ground can watch exactly what we're doing. I was looking at the bolt so they couldn't see earlier what the problem was until I put my head down and they saw what the problem was as well. Um, asked for them, their assistance, what we needed to do, and as a team we worked together to drive the bolt a little bit to free up the pistol grip tool, um, analyze how the electrical connector, if it was still working, they were t doing running tests on the ground. Uh, my second EVA partner, Michael Lopez Alegrea, uh, came over, took a look at it, gave an assessment, and so as a team we all worked together and were able to continue on with the rest of the spacewalk.